You know, the devil didn't want this to happen this morning. He was fighting against it. My daughter was sick on Friday. She's sick this morning. And it seems like any time I get up to preach, it's, you know, attack on the household, attack on me, or attack on something. And that just tells me God has something awesome in store for this morning. If we can just grab a hold of it, right? Amen. So I want to talk about being prepared. Or what's the opposite sometimes of preparedness? Being unaware. So prepared or unaware. That's what we're going to talk about. So I came across this. We've probably seen signs like this, right? Yeah. Can we flip the first two lights maybe? Yeah. Can you see that? It says, be prepared to stop. Okay? So that's a nice warning sign to get us prepared, right? <laughs> Do you think this person was aware or unaware? Okay? This looks like a group of people that are prepared. They're in a desert. They're standing around a water cooler. Looks like they could be prepared, right? How about these people? Were they prepared or were they unaware? Okay. Definitely caught unprepared, right? Aware, unaware. They're in the rain. Okay, we've sometimes been there, right? You ever been caught in the rain? This guy, though, was prepared. Do you ever feel like, though you prepare, it tends to follow you? Okay. I feel that way sometimes. Or maybe you're prepared, but yet there seems like there's nothing you can do about it. He's up to his chest in water, but it's still raining. Okay. Or maybe you try to get prepared, but you feel like this guy. And no matter how much you prepare, maybe you feel a little bit like this. Okay? Alright, so, this main scripture I want to share with you, this is what I came across yesterday. 